Hi everyone, Katie here with My Military Savings. Thank you for joining me today. I am going to walk you through a very simple winter themed arts and crafts project. I call them frosted candle holders and they are a lot of fun to make. Here in Georgia, we don't have white winter wonderlands, so this is the closest thing I'll have to anything snow-ish which is probably the reason why I love them so much. When you put a little tea light into these guys, it really creates such a nice, warm, cozy atmosphere. And they're so easy to do, which is another reason why I really, really like them. You can do a dozen of these in an afternoon, no problem. So what you need are some empty jars. You can do small, you can do big, empty pasta jars, pasta sauces, or you can use a mason jar. Check out your local thrift store, your local craft store, whatever you wanna use. You also need painter's tape and a coarse salt. You can use an Epsom salt or I happen to find a coarse kosher salt at my local dollar store and Mod, Mod Podge. So to get started, you get your painter's tape and you create whatever design you want to around your jar. I've done two simple strips right here and another one I've made, I used a couple more. And then I've even done the whole jar I frosted. So it's up to you, however you wanna do it. Wrap your painter's tape around. Make sure it's on there really, really well. And you are just going to coat this glass with Mod Podge. It can be a little bit messy, but you don't have to be pretty with it. Just paint the whole thing. Coat it really, really well. This can be a little bit messy, which would make it really fun for kids. It's totally doable for kids, so get them involved too. Just coat this really, really well. And this is so easy to do, but so pretty that these are great gift ideas. They would really make a fireplace pop, a nice centerpiece, decorate your tables with it. I'm going, I'm going all out here. I'm putting this stuff all over the place. I'm going all the way to the top. And once you've got it coated really well, you want to be generous, but you don't want to have Mod, Mod Podge gooping all over the place. So coat it really, really well. And then you are just going to shake that salt all over the place. I'd recommend doing this over a plate, but just coat it. Like so. Shake some of the excess off, coat some more. I love this salt because it really glistens in the candlelight. It's like crystals. All right. Now, while it's still wet, you are going to remove the painter's tape. and then set aside to completely dry. And you've got yourself a frosted candle holder. Now, I do recommend letting that dry before you handle it, but I will go ahead and show you. I like to fill them up with some extra salt to give your candle something to kind of sit on in there. Level it out and then drop that tea light in there. I use the flameless, but hey, whatever works for you. And then, let me turn my light off for you. You just have a nice, I need a candle for that one. Nice frosted candle holders. They're so easy, they're so fun, they're so cute. So, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you make some of your own. And if you would like to see more, fun holiday inspired arts and crafts or do it yourself projects, make sure you head over to mymilitarysavings.com. You can sign up for your membership today. It is free. Happy holidays, everybody.